So I turn on HBO, and what do I see? A former Maryland defensive lineman. Linebacker. Linebacker. Yes. Yeah. Jim Santa. I was uh, at Maryland from 74, 70 to 74. It's really worked out great. And I've done some title fights. I've been overseas and did some fights. And uh, uh, it was nice Jim Lampley mentioned uh, my name the other day uh, that I played football in Maryland. Referee Jimmy Santa in the ring. Former University of Maryland football player. Played on the same Terrapin team with Randy White. And if that helps get two or three more kids to this school, that, that's a, it's worth, all worthwhile. What do you take from being a linebacker some 30 years ago into the boxing ring today? Um, I think it's kind of like just focusing under pressure. Uh, you know, linebackers, it's like controlled mayhem. Yeah. And uh, that's what happens in the boxing ring. And it's, it's, you see some really tough guys and see some ex-football players in the ring. And uh, it, 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 did, it did definitely help me. It definitely helps me a lot. As far as the ex-football players go, you're in the right role in the ring today. Oh, yeah, I'm not getting hit. That's the best thing about it. When I was a freshman, Ralph was my coach. Was he? He recruited me. I went to Rye High School. He went to Harrison. And even though we were rivals, uh, he ended up recruiting me and ended up going to Maryland because of Ralph. How does it make you feel today that he's brought that success back? Uh, and it's definitely rough, and the people with him. Uh, it just makes you proud. My kids come down to the game, they know the fight song, and uh, it's, a, it's a great thing. It's, a, it's a one of the great pleasures in life. It makes it all worthwhile. All the, the four years of tough uh, playing for guy like, guys like Ralph, you look back now, and it's, it's more than memories. Now it's a reality. And uh, here I am going to all the Maryland games. I've been going for about 15 years. How many of your tackles did Randy White take before it oh, got many. to you? Millions, <laughs> millions. Now, he, Randy is where he is today because of me. Right. <laughs> they were triple teaming me. <laughs> well, I'm going to trust you on this, okay? If you had to equate Ralph to a current day boxer, who would it be? Uh, I would say probably Lennox Lewis. Mm -hmm. Big, smart, and hits you hard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just. I'm just thinking, you're Lennox Lewis, I'm Willie Pep. <laughs> now, nobody in this room knows who Willie Pep is. I remember Willie Yeah, Pepp. Willie Pep. Yeah, 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 sure, yeah. yeah. yeah boy. Lennox Lewis, huh? It's Lennox Lewis. Boy, that's a real compliment. You're not kidding. I thought it'd be more like Butterbean. <laughs> <laughs> you and, uh, and uh, Jim Santa go back a long way, Coach. We really do. I, I helped recruit Jim uh, here, and uh, you know he was a very good player for us. He played on the, the teams with Coach Claiborne back in the uh, 70s, and you know, I have an interesting story to tell about Jimmy. He, he was playing for Coach uh, Ross, and I was a GA for Coach Ross. And Coach Ross got on in practice one day, and and uh, he went and, as Coach Ross would always do. He would go into the locker room afterwards and just, you know, see how the boy was doing. And he couldn't find Jim, and so he had thought Jim had quit the team. So he had me looking all over the place. I was up in the, in the press box and back to the dorm, and finally came back, couldn't find him, and. We started walking over to lunch, figured he had quit, and Coach Ross was all dejected. And as we're walking to the dining hall, we hear somebody hitting the sled on the field. That's 45 right. minutes oh. later, Santa was still out there hitting the sled. So that's the kind of dedication he has, and that's why he's successful in business, too. He's a winner, and, uh, you know, he's a good turp. He's here supporting us every week, and I consider him a real friend. Jim Santa, our spotlight of Geico's Where Than Now. Coach and I will talk about Carolina when we come back. And also, don't forget Breakfast with the Fridge coming up Friday morning. Ralph Fridge and Show continues in a minute.